Welcome back, True Believers. This is Raktar, and today I am going to be doing one survival episode of this show. And I also thought I would show the, how the store works. So, in the store, you can only buy stuff that you have come across in the survival mode. And I've come across two things in survival mode. I've come across the cozy sweater. So I'm going to purchase cozy sweater. And I've come across the headlamp. Which is really expensive, but it makes it light, so when it, at like nighttime you can see really well, and it has defense. Oh, but I just now I own two. Oh, that was stupid of me. I understand how this works now. Okay, so anyways, yeah, you can come here and you can buy, and then you can equip those things in the actual like equip screen in game. But the reason I'm going to show the survival mode today actually is because. Should I be the- I'm gonna be the sick -a deer Look at- I've made it seven, seven generations as the sick -a deer But anyway, the reason I'm showing the survival mode is because the survival mode is how you get storyline episodes, and I don't have the next storyline episode, and I also was gonna show how to get the storyline episodes. Um, so basically... Basically, you see this area over here with, like, the three cell phones down there. It's in the bottom right. It's like three... It looks like data cards. I don't know. To get new storyline stuff, all you have to do... Like, they... It seems like they try and make it reasonably easy. But to get new storyline stuff, you can go for the high score, or you can just run over to the... Um... You can go, you can go for the storyline stuff, or you can go for a high score... Or you can kind of just run over to where they have the next storyline and pick it up. So basically, if I pick up those three data chips, I will unlock a new thing. But I'm going to try and go for, like, I don't know. I'll try and survive as long as I can as the sick of deer right now. As you can see, these birds, they're worthless to me on as a deer. You know what's really funny? Uh, wait. Is these birds will fight me now. Like, and it's really funny that, like, this little chick is willing to fight a deer. Like, I don't know, just the bravery of this little chicken to fight a deer really blows my mind. But, I don't, I don't know, I find that comical, but maybe it's not quite as comical as I find it. But yeah, in this mode, it's really... Like, I don't know, there's all these rabbits, no reason to do that. I'm gonna mark these things. I'm not actually gonna mate in this area, though, because... I don't want to meet in this area. Oh, you know what I can do? Can I do this? Is this how this works? I think I can put on... Oh! <gasps> yes! <laughs> oh man, cozy sweater. Oh, look at me. I am a freaking champion right now. So anyways, yeah, I gotta watch that mini-map. Uh, there's gonna be... My biggest fears in this area, I think, are dogs. Is what I've learned on the sick of deer. As you can see, I haven't unlocked a lot of new dudes, so I can nest here now. Um, nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna make sure I get the cell phone things. Like, I don't want to risk not getting them right now, so I'll come down to the Shibuya area. And what is this, Shibuya? I didn't even see what I'm in. But yeah, I'll come down here, and I'll make positive that I get these uh, cell phone parts. All right. Oh, there's a bunch of animals. Okay. Oh, oh, this is these are Pomeranians. All right. Luckily, the sick deer can run really fast and basically. Oh no. Your best bet. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Look at that. Did you see those sweet tactics right there? All right. Your best bet is yeah. Get in some. Get in some creep. Wait for that caution meter to go down. They can look around though, even while you're creeping. So. Oh, oh no, no, he got me. Let's get this gift. Okay. We can still get away. This can still happen. I like how, as a deer, I'm afraid of two little Palmer. In fact, you know what? Maybe I should be fighting these things. Like, it, I'm a freaking deer. This, I mean, it is just a Pomeranian, but, you know, maybe I could, like, man up and fight these things. I, I don't know. Okay, cool. I'm in safety now. I do need food, though. Oh, these bushes, by the way. Holy balls. These bushes are where the goods are at, because they give you 500 calories, and they are the things that give you, like, the most health. But I need more of these cell phones right now. Okay. 
This is, I wonder what kinds of enemies are up on top of the building. Am I gonna risk it? What's if, cause if they're like, oh, they're Pomeranians up here and cats. All right, we're not even gonna risk. We're gonna take the route on the ground because I don't even wanna deal with more Pomeranians. I like that the Pomeranian is like the weakest meat eater in the game, but as the weakest, um, as the weakest plant eater in the game, I am, wait, what is looking at me right now? Oh, those Pomeranians followed me down. Oh no, these are different dogs. Oh, and look, this other deer is afraid. Dude, screw this. This is such a bad idea, but there we go. Oh, do you see that? Sorry, Terrier. Oh, yeah. Dude, I was like, look, these freaking Jack Russell Terriers. I'm a deer. I should be able to beat a Jack Russell Terrier. Even if I am, like, the weakest. Oh. Oh, whatever. We're doing this. You're going down. Yeah. Sorry, Pomeranian. I love you. You know I love you, Pomeranian. I play as you. Okay, these are more... <gasps> these are my peeps! Ex Dude, can you believe this deer is hanging so close to these terriers? Oh man, how am I gonna... How am I gonna sneak past these freaking terriers? Whatever, we're taking a different route. I'm not gonna sneak past these stupid little Jack Russell terriers that are probably smarter than my honor student. Herder. Herfader, fader, fader. Alright. Oh man. I gotta get these three cell phones, if nothing else, like, that is what... I am doing reasonably well right now, but I did promise, if nothing else, that- Oh, what is that? Oh, oh those are golden freaking retrievers. Oh, man. Okay. If I think I can wait for them to go to sleep, maybe, at night, but... Yeah, it looks like- Oh, yeah. Using that sweet, sweet stealth. It is nice as the Pomeranian to be able to fight things, but... Oh, whoa! Oh, that is... Okay, this is a dog that I do not want to mess with. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, dude! That dog is a freaking beast! Alright, so... Oh, no, 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 my lover is gonna fight with... Okay, here we go. So... I figured, uh, what I would do... So when you die, if you've already collected one of the little data chips... Um, it, it, it stays collected, so I just have to go get the other two, but what I figured this time to make my chances of survival higher is I would mate, and so I decided I would just cut straight to where I find a mate in this one, and then you can kind of see what finding a mate does that will, like, once you see how it increases my chances of survival, you'll be like, oh, that is a great, a great reason to do this, because I really do want to get these chips in this episode. I am kind of sad that I died though, like that's depressing, but look, now I've got four little sick -a deer and um, yeah, they'll all help me fight, like if you hit triangle now, you can get your whole pack to battle with you. Not like battle against you though, I totally said that in a misleading way. And you know what's really funny is, your little deer when you mate, they start off little and adorable and they actually like grow up as you go, and since the time in this game moves really fast. It's really funny because you actually like you get to see your little guys grow up, you know? I don't know. It's just so adorable. This game I have seriously in the like less than a week since I have bought it I have seriously fallen in love with this game. It is so awesome. I would highly suggest if you own a PS3 I would highly suggest purchasing it and waiting for your little pack of adorable deer to catch up to you Right, so that first one is like three layers down, and I should probably also try to get to the marking point. Alright, what type of animal do we have over here? They're asleep, and they're... Oh, they're terriers, so we should actually try to avoid them. Although you did see me in the last little stint of survival, you did see me beat some terriers. Oh, dude, this one? I'm sorry, buddy. You've got to go. He's, al he's alone. He's got to go. Whoa. My caution just started going up there for a second, I don't even know why. Alright, um, I need some plants to eat. There's not a lot of plants this time around. See, that's another thing about this game is that... Oh. Oh, no. Alright, cats are pretty, pretty dangerous. And my toxicity is getting pretty high right now. What's my danger going up from? Did a cat see me, or is it because my toxicity is up so high? Oh, dude. So this area is very toxic. I really do need to find some plants. This is really like, because the, the spawning of plants in this game is like random, it's really unfortunate sometimes when you actually need some plants to live. Uh, but that's why 
now we can actually get on to the reason I made it this time was because uh, with all these other deer, when I die, um, the game just gets placed in the hands of the next deer. Oh, we gotta avoid that is the dog that killed us. I mean, that's not the dog, but that's the type of dog that killed me last time. Um, I saw a plant up here. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, we can do this. Eat. Eat your fill, my, my young dear friend. And, oh, the toxicity went away. Oh, beautiful. How much? Okay, that's as much of that plant as I can eat. Whatever. That kept my main deer alive. I've already, because the plant spawn was so unfortunate. Oh, no, there's another plant. I was about to say, because the plant spawn was so unfortunate this time, I don't want to lose any of these deer. I don't know if I can lose them. I think they, like, teleport to me, but... I just want to be certain that they're with me, because it's like my family. This is my brothers and sisters. Another interesting thing is you can't mate in the same place that your parents mated, so there's no like failure to launch shit going on in this game. Step one, eat a grasses. <laughs> I never think of like a grass as a thing. That might be, all right, come on, mark that shit. Yeah, raise my rank. Oh, I was like, my rank already was veteran. By the way, did you notice my deer got bigger? Like. It's like a slow and arduous process, so it's sometimes you don't even notice it happening, but I think it's totally awesome. What animal? Oh, it's a sheep. I was like, I was like, do I need, dude? Nah, I'm not gonna kill the sheep. I've got no reason to. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I'm gonna kill the sheep just for the fuck of it, just because I'm a piece of shit. Although I actually do sometimes, I will. Oh, and now I've unlocked another section of storyline. But you know what? I'm gonna keep this shit going until. I... I'm gonna keep this going until I die, and hopefully I can live for a very, very long time, but I don't know, my arcade scores haven't been rocking it so hot, but I think they purposely put the storyline stuff in areas that are nearby. Alright, so if I get another generation right now, let's try and get my rank up a little bit more so I can get a good mate. I feel like my second generation always turns out being only two deer, instead of like, oh, why can't I... I see a... Oh, it's up there, I see it. Oh, and it's a good plant, too. Oh, man, we gotta find where to get up there. Okay, there it is. Ho, ho, ho. That is a good plant. Okay. Oh! Oh, what a wicked, vicious jump. Dude, that plant will completely restore my health, though. Or my, um, my hunger meter. All right. We can do this. Ah! Uh, damn it. Oh man. If my main die guy dies just because I can't make this jump, oh, that time was so close. This is getting so annoying. If I I got to make this jump. This jump is life or this is a life or death jump. All right. Well, maybe my jumping level isn't like high enough or something. This deer is going to die. I'm just going to say it right now. There's not any plants around here. But I can find a... Oh, that's, that mate's got fleas. I don't want it. <laughs> I know, I shouldn't be picky with my mates when I'm about to die, but I am. Alright, so, bye, dear, but check it. I've got three. And this guy, I think, automatically gets equipped with the sweater and headlamp? Nope. What? I remember last time, but luckily... I've got extras. Alright. Oh, no, it still shows that I have two, though. Alright, cool. Yeah, boy. And I'm getting more gear towards getting new sweaters and headlamps. All right, so there's a nest right there. We just got to go pick up this mate, and hopefully this mate does not have fleas like the last one. Oh, sh it does. Uh, whatever, dude. This time, we're doing it. <laughs> Screw you. I, it's, it's such a dick move. Like, this sheep is just... Wait. It's still alive? It is... What? Did I not get the kill? Oh, dude, sheeps have a lot of health. Oh, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to really, okay, it's not even worth it at this point. Let's go get this bitch with fleas. I've got fleas now, but luckily my next generation won't have fleas, so it's okay. Oh, this is the nest that I couldn't figure out how to get into last time. Maybe it's up here. Oh, yeah. Haha, -ha, there we go. All right. By the way, what fleas does, in case you're wondering, since I haven't really come across fleas in my other... Ooh, nasty nasty. They're doing the nasty nasty. Since I haven't really come across fleas in the storyline, I'm gonna explain that... Happy happy birthday, sick of deer 9 But look, I've only got two in my pack now. 
Isn't that kind of frustrating? Like, but anyways, your new generation though has like added skills and stuff because I think the concept is that it kind of learned from the last generation. I don't know. So hopefully this will keep me alive a little bit longer. Although I'm not going to be able to get that food. In fact, now that I just weakened, like, my, I lessened my pack down to two, if I can't get that food this time, I'm kind of screwed. I'm shooting for, so the best I think I've done is like 18 years. Come on, this other deer sucks at moving. Hopefully these animals are not, all right. They don't appear to be asleep, so. Oh, they're, oh, those are hyenas, whoa. Can I get up, okay. We really gotta... Okay, I'm at the 10 year mark. I hear... Oh! I hear... Okay, those are cats. Alright, get out of here. Get out of here. Oh my gosh. We gotta get to some grass. Okay. Here we go. Caution's going down. This animal's still chasing, but... Oh, oh, they're chasing that bunny... Bunny Urbit. Maybe they'll keep chasing the bunny Urbit, or they're, they're gonna start looking for me if the caution doesn't go down faster. Uh, yeah, boy. Dude, let's kill one of these right now. Check this. Ooh. Yeah! Okay, now the other one is going down. Sorry, cat. You have to be a sacrifice to the death of yourself. You have to be a sacrifice to the gods of Tokyo. Because I really need to find a plan. Man, so I already know this area. I feel like in this game... Oh, and that, that god plant that used to be over here is gone now, so... I kind of missed my chance with that. What is... What is that weird sound? Oh, there's a plant over there. All right. These are bunny rabbits. I'm not worried about them. I am worried about the fact that there's a plant over here. Hopefully it's not next to like a cat or like a big dog. Oh, it's next to a, a sleeping Pomeranian. I'm sorry, bud. I love Pomeranians. Mm, sorry, big guy. <laughs> You're, oh, that cat heard me. Okay. Get into cover. All right, haha, -ha, sucker. That cat's a sucker. Okay, come on. Give me some nom. Give me some nom nom. Alright. There's a good plant up on top of that building, but there's a freaking... Should I just fight the cat? Yeah, I should just fight the cat. Alright, sorry cat. Dude, I love the deer's finisher because it does that sweet kick at the end. Hopefully that's not like a big... Oh, it's just a chicken. Hi, chicken. I don't care about ch Whatever. <laughs> I only killed the chicken because, like, the hit detection was making the chicken be in my way. Oh, there's, look at the, there's good plants up here. But there's also a cat down there. Oh, wait. Oh, that's a beagle. I'm gonna kill it. Oh, no. Oh, crap. It's gonna kill me. Oh, no. No. Okay, we made, we've made mistakes. Sorry, deer. All right, other sick of deer. It's up to you now. Get out. Get to safety. I don't even care about the good plants anymore. All right, I'm in safety now. I had a chance to sneak up on that freaking beagle and kill it, and I messed it up. Okay. Oh. Maybe it's not a good idea to go up here, but there's a really great plant right there, but my health is actually fine because... Okay, that's that beagle is fighting a cat. We're safe. I'm just gonna move move it along. Move it, move it right along, Rektar. <laughs> you are safe. There's no reason for you to be killing unnecessary beagles. Alright, we gotta... Oh, I was like, Pomeranian! I'm just running past it, but it's a dead Pomeranian, thanks to me. Alright, what do we got here? Dude, every time I come up on animals, I'm just like... Okay, it's- oh, it's a family! I should be able to, like, recruit them. Hey guys, you wanna join my family? Hey, guys, guys! <laughs> come on! Don't you care- oh, that's where the nest is gonna be. It's like, don't you guys care about the survival of the race? Or anything like that? Alright, um... Oh, wow, so the nesting points, one of them... appears to be down this alleyway. So, we gotta do some climbing. We got a Pomeranian here. Let's see if we can get a clean kill. Sorry, buddy. You have to die for the survival of my people. Oh, is there... How do I... Oh, no, I remember this place. You just gotta walk past this thing. Wait, what? How could I get up over this crap? What is the deal with this building? Um... Can I, like, jump over this way? I'm confuzzled right now at what's happening. I guess I have to climb this building. Which... Oh. 
Oh, man. Oh, come on. Beagle. He sees me. No, he doesn't. Dude, we're gonna get risky here. We're gonna get risky, get frisky. Okay. No. Oh, run, 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 run! This is death! Whatever. I've unlocked another portion of storyline. Um... Sadly, I don't think my score was that impressively high. But hey, like I said, I unlocked more storyline. I got to show the survival and how to get storyline, so that's a plus. So with that, uh, thank you. Actually, let's see. Let's see my score before I continue. Before I commence with the pleasantries, uh, twelve thousand. That's not very good. And I'm not hooked up to the internet on the PS3 right now, so I can't. Well, anyways. This has been Raktar. Thank you for watching.